A newly unsealed deposition offers new insight into Jeffrey Epstein's close associate and former girlfriend, Ghislaine Maxwell. Maxwell gave sometimes evasive answers in the 2016 deposition, taken as part of a civil suit by Epstein accuser Virginia Giuffre. Maxwell is accused of recruiting underage girls for Epstein's alleged sex trafficking ring and participating in the sex abuse herself. Think about that. However, she has long denied any involvement in this. And Armola Lange continues to follow the case. According to the deposition, Ghislaine Maxwell says she knew Jeffrey Epstein was a registered sex offender. When asked if she recruited girls on Epstein's behalf, she said, I don't recruit anybody and appeared disgusted, saying, I resent and despise the word recruit. Throughout the testimony, Maxwell dodged questions about Epstein's alleged abuse of underage girls and repeatedly called Epstein accuser Virginia Giuffre a liar. Maxwell, defending herself, said, I can't think of anything I have done that is illegal. While being questioned about her initial meeting with Jufre, Maxwell's anger appeared to boil over, and she harshly pounded the table, later apologizing for the behavior. Jufre alleges Epstein and Maxwell sexually abused her when she was underage and lent her out to their friends. In a July interview with CBS This Morning, Jufre said Epstein was a sick pedophile, but Maxwell was the mastermind. She is even worse than Epstein. She, she put it this way, Epstein was Pinocchio and she was Gisbetto. Pulling the strings? Yep, she was pulling the strings. She had his money, he had her contacts. They made a great group that way. But Yilin was much more conniving and smart than Epstein ever was. At one point during the deposition, Jufre's attorney, Sigrid McCauley, appeared to ask Maxwell about the now infamous picture of Jufre and the UK's Prince Andrew. Jufre says she had sex with the prince at Maxwell's London home that night. The prince has repeatedly denied Jufre's allegations, and Maxwell called Jufre's account of the incident an obvious lie. In the deposition, Maxwell said Jufre characterized things took place in my bathroom, in the bathtub itself. The tub is too small for any type of activity whatsoever. What was your takeaway of Ghislaine as a person? She's really intelligent. She's perhaps a bit too clever. She obviously believes that she should give up nothing. CBS News legal analyst Ricky Kleeman says the deposition could create problems for Maxwell at trial. Anything particularly damaging? The jury is going to wonder why she doesn't have some kind of story that is other than everyone else is lying. In addition, pounding on the table does not get you anywhere in a criminal court. Well, in a statement to CBS News, Virginia Giuffre's attorney says Maxwell's deposition is only a fraction of the evidence against her. And as more is released, they say, it'll become increasingly apparent why Maxwell and other Epstein enablers fought so hard to keep these documents sealed. Now, as we've reported, as you know, Jeffrey Epstein died by suicide while in federal prison in Manhattan awaiting trial last year. Meanwhile, Ghislaine Maxwell is in federal prison here in Brooklyn. She's been here since July and is waiting for her trial, which is scheduled for next year. Tony. Very interesting. Well, we know you'll keep following it for us. Thank you very much.